Hi everyone, this is Conundrum back again with another reaction video. And this reaction is a Lost of Space, Season 1, Episode 10. And this is the last episode called Danger Will Robinson. But before I say anything, please like, comment, and share. Like, comment, and share. And definitely hit that subscribe button along with that bell. That way you get notified when I have new videos coming out. Not on the episode. We saw a lot of things going on with the family. First starting off with the dad and finding out where exactly he was. So, as you saw in the episode, he was hanging on for dear life. Him and Don was hanging on to dear life and uh, what was left of the ship outside the planet and basically you saw them trying to figure out a way to get anyone alerted to what they were where, where they were and what was going on so of course that was a good portion of the episode as well and we also saw dr smith along with the robot come back with with judy and also maureen basically to get back on the ship so they can get off the planet because they are the last ones on the planet so during that time when they do decide that they're going to get on the ship, the robot has lost all control when it comes to being well, responding to or dealing with Will Robinson. So, of course, Will doesn't have any type of control over the robot. He is now being controlled by Dr. Smith, of course, who doesn't really, you know, think that, of course, that anybody should have control besides her and of course she has her own agenda which is something we always know about her so of course you know through the episode we also see them trying to figure out a way basically to get off the planet of course and eventually do get off the planet and eventually trying to figure out a way to actually save john and also don bus of course because of the fact that they are in out in space they don't know exactly where they are so they eventually figure out a way don west and john basically figure out a way basically to let off a kind of beacon i want to say a light that way they can alert be alerted to what's going on with the actual you know place that they're at and that way people can get in contact with them the big other problem is the fact that the Resolute is actually supposed to be leaving orbit within a certain amount of time. And also, too, Don and John are both running out of air. So, of course, this is becoming a very hazardous moment in time for them trying to deal with that stuff. So they don't know what to do at this point. So, again, we also see them you know, rushing to their aid to try to get to them as quickly as they can. So we do see Dr. Smith actually have a heart. She actually does to take and actually help out John in the episode because of the fact that basically she decides that she's going to take over ship Dr. Smith and um, Maureen is basically going to shoot this actual uh, harpoon towards where Don and also John are because of the fact that they finally let out the flare and they were able to find them. So of course the first time it does not work. The second time actually was done by Dr. Smith surprisingly enough because of the fact that she wanted to say, wanted to do the right thing. She said she was sorry, which is something that we're trying to interested enough to see and trying to figure out if she actually is sorry about anything. And also we see Will actually get in contact with the robot again and toward the end of the episode we actually see another robot come out of the blue and we're trying to figure out what exactly is going on with the second robot why is this robot feeling some type of way so of course we see the second robot actually take down um will has to take down the mother as well when they're in the actual cockpit not the cockpit but actually in the bottom part of the ship and then we also see penny and judy actually stuck in the vehicle where they can't get out so obviously they're trying to you know handle that situation with the robot so the robot actually turns back and helps will which is kind of surprising considering that the new robot is i guess his friend but they don't understand the reason why, or the, the second robot probably doesn't understand the reason why that the first robot decided to go back and help Will. Now, we did see an interesting object that was underneath the actual um, truck that they were in. We're not sure what the object was, but apparently it was something very, very important. So it's interesting definitely to see that going on. Now, we're not sure what exactly happened to the robot because both robots ended up you know, going off the ship after the fact that the Will got the first robot to turn back to its normal self and then it hit the other robot and took him off the ship and they winded up in space. So we ended up seeing a whole different ball game when it came to how the robots dealt with each other and then of course trying to figure out, you know, how they're going to get out from where they are because the Resolute is supposed to be leaving. So we also see that Will actually falls off the actual ship at one point. John, lucky enough, does save him because of the fact that that harpoon did come and help him out and get them back to where they need to be. And then, of course, we also saw the Resolute actually come back, and we also saw Victor actually come back and help them and decided that they're going to come back and get them back to the actual Resolute and go from there. But before that happens, of course, we see something different happen. We see that object that was underneath the, the, underneath the actual truck actually start to branch out and start to take over actually the, the actual ship. So, of course, when they're in China trying to figure out 
what's going on, that the ship gets taken over, and of course it takes off in a whole different direction, in a whole different direction of space, which is definitely interesting to see. And of course, you know, the Resolute is left wondering what's going on, why they're going off a different way, even though Maureen also feels the same, like we have no idea where this thing is going. So, toward the end of the episode, we actually see where they ended up. They ended up in a whole different part of space with two rings or two circles. And Will actually shows a picture that says, Danger Will Robinson, or Danger, because of the fact that where he's going apparently is not a good place to go. Now, of course, this episode leaves us with a lot of questions to be answered. Did the robots survive, either one of them, because of the fact they fell the ship, although they don't breathe air, did they survive anything? What is this new robot that is taking control over the actual ship? What is it going to do to them? And is it going to be helping them out? And how is it going to be handled that way? Can they get contact with the Resolute? Is the Resolute going to be able to get in contact with them and help them back home? Because now they're in a whole different part of space. And what's going to happen to Dr. Smith? Dr. Smith is actually in being held now. But of course, she has a plan. And you can tell that she looks like she has a plan to actually get out. So is she going to get out? Is she going to figure out a way to take over the ship? How is that going to work out? Is the family going to be able to heal through all the problems that they had on the actual planet? And as we learned before, originally they were actually going to re-land back on the planet because of the fact that they were didn't have enough fuel to actually to make it to the Resolute. So we shall see what happens. So here are my final thoughts about the whole season. The season was pretty good. It started out kind of slow. It kind of worked its way through a lot of interesting points, a lot of drama was going on. And I appreciated everything that was going on. So I'm very interested to see it come back for a second season and see see how things turn out and so this is my final thoughts my final thoughts are it's a great science fiction show it starts out well it definitely branches into a whole different realm of how people feel about different things and a whole different new aspect of how a robot should act or could act and go from there so of course I'm always interested in see a new season of this coming out soon rather than later. But of course, let me know how you feel as well. You know, did you like the whole season? Did you hate it? Did you think it was great? You know, what are your thoughts on what's going on and what's going to happen in the near future? Please let me know down in the comment section. I always appreciate hearing about that. And of course, before I sign off, please like, comment, and share. Like, comment, and share. And definitely hit that subscribe button when I come out with new videos from that bell. So this is me, The Conundrum, signing off for another great season of... Boston Space. You guys have a great rest of the weekend. Peace.